Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 16th of April 1902, Thomas Lincoln Talley opened the Electric Theatre, America's first purpose designed movie theatre. Thomas Talley was born in Texas, but moved to California when he was in his early 30s and established a successful phonograph parlour. Customers had access to a number of phonograph machines that would play a wax cylinder audio recording after a coin was dropped in the slot. Having proved incredibly popular, by 1896 Talley had expanded his business to include kinetoscope motion picture machines that allowed customers to view early films through a peephole. As interest in motion pictures grew, audiences were soon treated to the arrival of the Vitascope and later the mammoth projecting kinetoscope that were able to project films onto a wall or screen. Variety and vaudeville managers began including motion pictures on the bill, while owners of phonograph parlours scrambled to purchase statewide rights to operate the equipment. In California, Thomas Talley secured the licence and initially curtained off the back of his phonograph parlours to create an improvised movie theatre. By 1902, Talley was finding it increasingly difficult to secure venues that were big enough to accommodate the audiences who wished to see his films. Consequently, on the 16th of April, he opened the first purpose-designed movie theatre at 262 South Main Street in Los Angeles. Housed in an existing building, Talley designed his electric theatre to accommodate around 250 patrons. It proved incredibly popular with the public and sparked a revolution in cinema history. Within a few years, Nickelodeons began appearing across the country, while the creation of film exchanges enabled exhibitors to access a constant supply of new films to keep their audiences entertained. (laughs) 